I promise you last night I came in late so I can cut that video so it can be ready for today by noon. The thing has like five views. And the question is like, what do you really want? If my why wasn't big enough, I would just stop doing them. What's up, what's up, what's up? What's going on guys? It is August 1st. 2024 man we eight months through the year man 2024 is, is just flying it's flying it's flying man damn like oh man this year is flying time is just flying man it just seems like time is just going faster than it used to go uh it is um 7 38 in the morning um, we are at 92 days before launch of the All Dreams platform. If this is your first time, my name is Hassan El Sadiq. Thank you for tuning in to my daily, um, whatever we're doing here, you know, my daily documentation of uh, my building my startup, um, showing you the things that I'm doing. Um, as I'm learning, I'm sharing with you. Um, so really just here to add value. But um, on this Thursday, the first thing that was on my mind today, and it's like a question to you, okay? Like the people that may watch this video. And the question is like, what do you really want? Like that's a, that's, it's a serious question. And it's the reason why I asked that, because most people really don't know what they really, really want. Like, what do you really want? Like, what outcome do you want to have from whatever you're doing? Because it has to be in that order, right? Where you have to want something in order to create the outcome, right? Do the thing to create the outcome that you want, right? But I think people don't really think about what they really want. And they think about what they want, but they think about what they want right now. It's not a good thing, okay? Now is necessity. What do I actually need right now in order to get what I really want? How that looks for me is, hey, let's let's live on a lower scale so we can get what we really want, right? And we can build what we really want to build without a bunch of pressure on your shoulders of living above your means while you're going after what you really want. Okay? And that's a thought that you really, really need to think about. What do you really want? What do you really, really want for yourself? Because that's where it starts. You know? Um, what outcome do you want? What are you, and then, what are you gonna do in order to get the outcome? Okay? Are you gonna sacrifice? Because it does. Whatever you want. Real results. It's going to have to be a sacrifice. And no matter what, like it doesn't matter whether you work a job, whether you do YouTube, whether you build a company, all of these things is going to be pain, you know? And that's why it's very, very important to figure out what you really want, right? And then reverse engineer that. How can I get to that outcome? What do I need to do? Set up the steps in order to get what you really want, okay? And that's the question for today. What do you really want? And 
I'm going to get to work and uh, you guys have a wonderful day. Slay the day, kick the day ass, let's go. going on guys headed over to play basketball did a little even little workout um, finished my task for today it's a pretty smooth day uh, man yo one thing I wanted to talk about is like Why does the United States think that everyone cares about what's going on in the United States? Like, I promise you that here, these people, right? These everyday people that are Colombian is not worried about what's going on in the United States. And it's really a relief that it's like that, right? Um, because the only way that I'm like, like even paying attention, the only reason I'm even paying attention is because my family's in the States, you know? Like, if my family was here, like I don't even think I would have no connection to the States like that and all this crazy shit that's going on this presidential election, like, that, the whole news yesterday with uh, with Trump going to the black journalists um, association for, for interview, that was a shit show. And man, that, that lady was, was, she was nasty, man. She was nasty, but I'm not even gonna get into any of that stuff or whatever, because honestly, it doesn't concern me. Because being here, like I literally feel like I'm in a completely another world. And the crazy thing about it is <laughs> people in the United States really feel like other people gives a fuck about what's going on in the United States and people don't like the arrogance and the audacity that Americans have like yo it's all eyes on us in our presidential election <laughs> like no one cares bro so that's what I wanted to say about that man I just really feel relieved all the time it's kind of like i'm like like i said in another world that that's not even that i don't even know about united states i just don't have those problems when i'm here um i want to talk about something else like as far as like yo Nobody's watching my YouTube channel. And you know what's so crazy? I don't care. I think it's going wonderful. Like, I love the videos that I'm putting out. I think it's a lot of value. I'm having fun doing it. And the reason I'm mentioning this is because Look, if my why was to get views and my why, of course my why is to get views. Let me let me go back on that. Of course, I want viewers. I want viewership for sure. 
but if my only why was to get views, um, I would quit. I would quit. So this is just an example I'm giving of that you have to have a big enough why. Because other than that, man, I'm telling you, like, you'll quit. Like, I promise you, last night, I came in late so I can so I can cut that video so it can be ready for today by noon. And like, I thought it was a good video. I think there's some real value in there. Talking about value proposition in there. Talking about some 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 good stuff. And the thing has like five views. Like, I'm telling you, if my why wasn't big enough, I would just stop doing them. But my why is way bigger than YouTube, doing things for YouTube uh, views, doing things for YouTube clout, doing things for my viewers. I'm honestly not doing this for my viewers. Like people say, okay, well, your viewers like this video, so you should make videos more like that. It's not what I'm doing it for. I'm doing it for a completely different reason. I'm documenting journey all the way up until launch and then after launch, right? I'm documenting building a company. This is something that's gonna live past anybody that would like me for if I made a, a video that they liked, okay? Because then the next video I make, they might not like, right? So the point about it is have a big enough why Have a big enough why when you do something, when you do anything, have a, have a big enough why. And remember the message from the morning time, what do you really want? Remember that, ask, your, ask yourself these questions. Like, what is my why? Like, what do I really want? Like, these are valid questions that you should ask yourself, I promise you. Like, you get these answers, you get these answers in a hero story for sure, but um, these are valid questions to ask yourself when you're doing anything that you're trying to do. Even if you go to a job, like, yo, what do I really want out of this job? I'm trying to build this business. What do I really want? What is my why for um, trying to get this job? What is my why for trying to build this business? And it can't solely be about money. Like, if it's just about money, it's like, Okay, now you got the money now, or it gets hard and you didn't make the money, then you, you're probably gonna quit. You're probably gonna do the, do, you know, go on to the next thing. So, yo, have a why. Ask yourself, yo, why? Why do I want this? Ask yourself, what do I really want? Ask yourself these questions. And if you do, things will start coming, becoming more clear. And, One more plug about the hero story framework like look you do the hero story framework course with me all of those questions will be answered within part two and from there you start building on what you really want to build and what you really want to do and why you really want to do it right so, look, I'm walking up to the court, and um, I'm out, man. See you guys tomorrow. 92 days before lunch, baby. All right? Peace.